guys and welcome to the start of my Sarasota Florida vlog. I am so happy to be here. The weather is already giving me life. It is now Saturday morning. We just pulled in. We're going to go to the Sarasota Farmer's Market. We are here for the week. It's me, Spencer, and my mom, and we are staying with my uncle. And it's so nice to see him and just spend the week here. We have a few things planned, but overall it's just going to be like a relaxing vacation. We are going to look at a wedding venue, which I'm really excited for, but I figured I would go ahead, vlog this trip. I love having the memories to look back on, and I'm trying to get back into the swing of things on YouTube. If you missed my last vlog, basically I was taking a small break to just really focus on my business. And then also when I went to vlog again, my camera broke. So I got a new camera. We should be all good now. I'm so excited to be back and I'm excited to go hit up this farmer's market. First stop is always coffee. I got an ice latte with mocha from ONA coffee super good they have so many cute little stands they have like clothes coconuts food produce anything you could ever want so my mom just got a smoothie from this little stand over here they have all organic i don't know what would you even call that it's just, it's just everything so this is the deep blue sea it tastes very earthy it was actually really good it's like really refreshing So we just got to the Ringling Museum, which is one of our options for a wedding venue. So I'm so excited to go in, check it out. One of the ladies I've been emailing with back and forth is actually setting up for a wedding today. So I'm hoping we'll kind of get a better idea as to what it would look like if we were to have our wedding here, depending on which location they have it, because I think there are a few different locations within the museum that you can have the wedding. But I wanted to show you guys my outfit because I love it so much. I got this top from Anthropology. It was on their clearance rack, so I don't know if I'm gonna to be able to link it down below but I think it's so fun it's kind of like a corset with all these flowers and feathers I absolutely love feathers I actually had feathers on one of my prom dresses in high school fun fact and then I'm wearing my white mother jeans and then for my heels I'm wearing my Stuart Weitzman heels Spencer you want to do a little outfit of the day I feel like I've worn this before the same as that guy <laughs> but this is like a Zara linen top lemon and, uh, Vejas. Vejas. I love this outfit. It's actually one of my favorites that you wear. You. Mom, you want to give a little outfit? <laughs> Jude Connolly. Jude Connolly dress. Yeah. Very cute. Love it. Just a Target purse. It's cute though. If I can find the purse, I'll link it down below because I feel like it's a really nice vacation bag. absolutely so. stunning I mean I've been to the museum before but it's been about five years probably since I've been here and I feel like it's even prettier than I remember and they're setting up for a wedding it's absolutely stunning they have the acrylic chairs these gorgeous chandeliers hanging in the tree just absolutely beautiful and then they're setting up the dance floor up there which you can't really see but they have like black and white tiles and just this whole area is breathtaking it's so grand yeah it's unlike anything, like it's the coolest wedding. I feel like this is like hidden, like, like how, how have I not heard of, heard of this? <laughs> Time for the beach. Finally, I'm so excited. We actually tried to go earlier this morning, which I didn't vlog, but I'm kind of glad I didn't because we literally just drove around in circles for like 30 minutes. We couldn't find parking. It was so bad. But... Siesta Key is like crazy busy and it's also a Saturday, so I don't know what we thought was gonna it's happen. It's also Mother's Day weekend. Oh yeah, that too. So. Mother's Day is tomorrow. Um, but Spencer and I are gonna head to the beach. My mom, my uncles decided to just stay at home. I think they're pretty tired from walking around the museum all day, but it was so much fun. 
and I just loved it there. It was like the best time and we're really excited. So yeah, we're gonna head to the beach. I'm so excited. We went to a sunset last night. Like we caught the last maybe like five minutes of it and the beach here is incredible. I think it's voted like number one or number two beach in the whole US and the sand is like powder and it's so white. The it's water beautiful. is so clear. Good morning guys, today is Wednesday. I actually didn't vlog the last couple of days. I just was trying to spend some time in the moment enjoying our vacation. And then we also had some business to attend to, which maybe I'll disclose it in a vlog coming up, but I'm not ready to talk about it just yet. Just wanna make sure everything kind of works out the way it's supposed to. But anyways, like I said, today is Wednesday. My uncle took off work today, so he's gonna be spending the day with us. We decided to not go to the beach today just because a few of us are sunburned and then Spencer actually had has a little congestion going on we're hoping it's just allergies and he's not getting sick and then I woke up super dizzy I don't know what that's about it's getting a little better but still not perfect but I wanted to pick the vlog back up I think we're gonna head to the Sarasota UTC mall which I'm really excited um, there's a lot of shops nearby do a little shopping and then I don't really know what the rest of the day entails. I think we're pretty much just gonna be shopping all day. My mom mentioned maybe going to a couple thrift stores, which we did do also this week, which we did really good at. It's always fun going to like different thrift stores in new towns. But anyways, yeah, so we're gonna do a lot of shopping today and then later tonight I have dinner with a friend from high school. She lives in St. Pete, so I think I'm gonna get dinner with her and then actually one of Spencer's friends from high school now lives in St. Pete, so he's gonna get dinner with him while I'm getting dinner with my friend. But anyways, I wanted to go ahead and check in, show you guys what I'm wearing today. I have on my Anina Bing Paris t-shirt, which I have worn this week. I washed it, just like a good go-to t-shirt to throw on, my everyday necklaces. And then I'm wearing my Levi's. I love these shorts. They're like a two-tone color block denim sort of thing. I got them at Marshall's. They were really cheap. And then I'm wearing my sandals, which it's my first time wearing them. Well, not my first time since this trip, but this trip has been my first time wearing them. They are Jenny Kane, and I got them at Nordstrom Rack. I got a really good deal on them, and I've been getting a lot of use out of them since we've been here, and I love them. Also, everyone, meet Henry. This is my uncle's sweet little miniature schnauzer. He's the cutest thing ever. A little feisty, but look at his little pigtails. Such a sweet loving little boy i'm trying to pet him but i'm holding a sandwich in my other hand <laughs> look at his little tongue sticking out i can't it's too much <laughs> So I have the best lunch date. We have Spencer, my uncle, uncle, Forrest. uncle Forrest, and my mom. Spencer and I just ordered a crab cake for an appetizer. Definitely gonna dig in because we are starving. We just dropped off my mom and uncle at Old Navy. We're sitting in the car waiting on them in the meantime. We didn't really get much at the mall. Spencer didn't no. get anything, and I only got one thing at Lululemon, which is kind of the reason I wanted to go. I feel like I really don't need that much. I mean, I need more like summer tops, but I just don't really know exactly what I'm looking for. If you guys have any like store recommendations on good shops to just buy like cute summer tops, then please comment down below because that is the one thing my closet is lacking. But the only thing I got at Lululemon are a line biker shorts, which they're all like tucked up because I tried them on just black little spandex shorts, which I thought would be nice because all I have are like normal athletic running shorts and I feel like I will get a lot of use out of those and now I want them in more colors. Then we got a coffee. Oh yeah, then we did get a coffee. This is our new favorite since we've been here. I feel like Starbucks just came out with it. It's the white chocolate macadamia cream cold brew. Yep. 10 out of 10. So yes. freaking good. So. And it's not horrible for you. Yeah, no, it's not that bad. So now we're waiting on them and I don't know what we're doing after. I'm really tired. My dizziness did get a little better. I can't talk. 